Can I remind you, this inquest, adjourned for the funerals of the deceased, is now reconvened. It's our primary aim to investigate the sequence of events that led to the road traffic collision at the bend of Newton Road, known locally as Biker's Dream, resulting in two fatalities. Since the victims, though in two separate cars, were part of the same incident, I'm going to take the two cases together. Members of the families, do you agree? Now, the purpose of this inquest is not to apportion blame, but to establish who the victims were, where, when, and how they died. So I'd like to call to the stand first, please, the collision investigator. From my study of the markings on the road and the position of the two vehicles involved, I draw the following conclusions. The two cars were travelling north on Newton Road, with vehicle one on the inside lane and vehicle two pursuing on the outside right-hand lane. At the bend known as Biker's Dream, the front of vehicle two made contact with the rear of vehicle one. Skid marks on the road indicate that the driver of vehicle one lost control came off the carriageway and impacted with a tree. This vehicle subsequently caught fire. Vehicle two then continued on north on Newton Road, coming into contact with roadside furniture. This caused vehicle two to rotate and flip over several times, ejecting the front seat passenger from the vehicle before coming to rest on the carriageway. Can you estimate the speed of the two vehicles? Yes, I calculate that both vehicles were travelling at between 55 and 60 miles per hour.